हेलो एवरीवन हियर डॉक्टर जाहिद अंसारी प्रोफेसर ऑफ कंप्यूटर साइंस एंड इंजीनियरिंग इन दिस वीडियो आई विल डिस्कस अबाउट हाउ टू पेंट लाइंस टू अ पैनल यूजिंग जावा स्विंग विल टेक अ पेंट एग्जांपल विल क्रिएट अ प्रोग्राम इन विच विल क्रिएट अ क्लास कॉल्ड पेंट पैनल एंड दैट इनहेरिट्स द जे पैनल in this program we'll try to create the random lines to be displayed in this panel in order to create the random lines we use the random number generations to compute the end points of the these lines okay so we go to the program over here so this is our program to paint lines to a panel we first import the required packages we create a class paint panel which extends the j panel so our paint panel it's a panel in order to take care of the borders of the panel we are declaring a data point edit ins of type insets and in order to randomly generate the end points of the line we are using an object of random in the constructor of the paint panel we are setting the border for the panel so we are setting the color of the border red and thickness of the border to 5 okay and in order to make use of the random number generation class we are instantiating random okay and we are uh, creating an object rand over here now in order to draw the lines on the panel we are overriding the paint component method over here the paint component method it takes a graphics object okay yeah before we do our painting we make sure that we call the super class paint component method first okay so in our case the j panel is the super class so we we are calling super dot paint component this so it will call the paint component method of the super class okay after that we are declaring x y x2 y2 right these are to capture the end points of the line okay x y is the starting point and x2 y2 is the ending point okay we are we are getting the height and width of our panel by calling the method get height and get width okay then in order to get the border information border dimension we are calling the method get insets and that we are storing in the object ins over here now we are generating we are we, we want to draw 10 lines over there so in a for loop we are using the random number generator okay rand object to get an integer value right and this integer value we are specifying the width over here to get the int in integer value for x right we are specifying the width and from the width uh, we are subtracting the left dimension of the border for similarly to compute the y value we are subtracting the bottom margin from the height same thing we are doing for x2 y2 this we are doing so it should not happen that uh, our end points they are touching the border okay so once we compute the values of x y x2 y2 randomly 
after that we call the method draw line on the graphics object by providing the endpoints x y and x2 y2 okay so the line is drawn 10 times because our loop iterates 10 times okay so this is the imp implementation of our paint component class okay now we come to the driver our driver class over here that is pen demo okay it has a data member that is pen panel object pp in the constructor of this pen demo we are first create the top level container a jframe object we give the name to the title pen demo we set the size of the frame to 200 pixel by 150 pixel where 200 is the width and and 150 is the height okay uh, when the close button is clicked then we want the program to end so on the frame we are calling cell set set default close operation jframe dot exit on close so exit the program when the uh, close button is clicked okay after that we are instantiating our paint panel class object so pp we are instantiating okay and this our paint panel object we are adding to the content pem associated with our frame so we are calling the method add on the our jframe object and we are passing our uh, paint panel object as a parameter to this to make sure that the frame is visible we are calling the method set visible and passing the parameter true to make the frame to be visible okay now from inside the main okay uh, we are instantiating our uh, paint demo class okay and in order to make sure that uh, it gets instantiated in an event dispatching thread we are calling this from the from inside uh, from inside the swing utilities in invoke later where we are creating an instance of runnable and providing the implementation of method run and within method run we are instantiating our pen demo class okay so le let's let's run it so see here okay i'll maximize it okay so many lines they are drawn okay over here i will minimize it okay okay i'll yeah i'll try to restore it okay here so this way yeah okay i'll maximize it i'll restore it again all right so every time when uh, uh, it is resized and all then that uh, method pen component is called and every time we get the next set of the lines over here okay so and if we change the if if if, if we increase the number of lines let's say i make it 100 okay so i am just closing it and we are saving it and i'm running it again see now we are generating the 100 lines over here okay, 100 and annual lines over here. so this way we can paint line on a panel okay this finishes our demo